This video clip is addressed to the chair of Colchester Borough Homes, Mrs. Alison Inman, and the chief executive of Colchester Borough Homes, Mr. Greg Falvey. I received a message left on my um, telephone answer phone this morning from Barclay Young. I will now quote what that message says. Hi Mrs. Callianne, it's Barclay Young from Colchester Borough Homes. Um, you called our customer services team yesterday to speak to Alison. Alison is away at the moment, but she has asked me to, to give you a call back and talk through any of the issues that you might have. So if you would like to call me back on 282518, I'll be happy to discuss them with you. Um, that actually wasn't the case when I phoned back. Mr Young does not want to discuss anything with me or any issues that I bring up. Um, I called back 20 or so minutes later. Mr Young asked me what it was that I wanted. Um, I said, you called me. Um, I responded that I wish to speak with Mrs Inman, the chair of the board of Colchester Borough Homes. Mr Young responded that Mrs Inman refuses to speak to you and she does not have to respond to the issues you are raising, which actually is a contradiction of the message that was left on my answer phone. Um, I then communicated the various issues that remain unresolved, which are the issues that I want to talk through so we can move to mutually agreeable resolution. Mr Young informed me that we have already dealt with these issues. I asked, who is we? Mr Young responded, Colchester Borough Homes. I asked, who at, at Colchester Borough Homes? I was informed, we have told you before. I queried what I had been told before to be informed that I may not challenge what I have been told. As far as Alison Inman and Greg Falvey are concerned, the matters, but they don't state what matters, are dealt with and there is nothing more to be said. Communication is now suspended. Please consider, if you will, Dealing with something and resolving something to a mutually agreeable resolution are two very different things. Responding with false evidence, saying that the evidence may not then be challenged, and then saying further communication is suspended there is, because there's nothing more to be said, results in one party dealing with a problem and resolving it um, to their satisfaction only. Um, it resolves the problem by um, then not having to deal fairly and honestly with the issue. I find it interesting that Barclay Young is offering verbally what Mrs Inman and Mr Falvey have asked him to relay. I would ask that Mr Falvey and Mrs Inman please put in writing what was communicated verbally via Mr Young this morning um, and endorse with their signature, namely that no tenant can challenge what is said by Mrs Inman and Mr Falvey and that Mrs Inman and Mr Falvey in their capacities of Chair and Chief Executive of Colchester Borough Homes Limited do not have any responsibility or duty of care to respond or address outstanding issues and moving towards mutually agreeable resolution. I would ask please for the Chair of Colchester Borough Homes to put that in writing endorsed with your signature and also for the Chief Executive to put that in writing and endorse with your signature. Currently um, the issues that are being brought up is the duty of care which is being brought into question um, that Colchester Borough Homes officers have towards um, their clients or customers and also um, the duty of care of um, the Chief Executive in his position as Chief Executive of Colchester Borough Homes, the duty of care and responsibilities that he has towards Colchester Borough Homes, the legal entity. Um, perhaps you would get back to me at your earliest possible convenience. Thank you.